So you might have found yourself in this position before where you got a model and you think you're done, but maybe you or a client wants you to make a major change. Let's say add wings. You might see that as you're trying to add a brand new limb to your character model and you're trying to stretch it out, we start getting this terrible stretching of the polygons. If I turn on polyframe, it's even worse. That's because polygons are not supposed to be stretched this way. Don't worry. Sculptress Pro is a tool created exactly to fight this problem. To turn on Sculptress Pro, you first need to choose a brush that is compatible with it. So I'm going to choose the snake hook brush. It even says this brush performs best when Sculptress Pro mode is activated. Skip that for today. All you have to do is press this big button right here that activates Sculptress Pro. It looks like a little S or the backward slash on your computer. Once you do so, you'll notice that your mouse cursor is going to change to a purple color. That means Sculptress mode is on. If for any reason there's an incompatibility with Sculptress Pro, the mouse will turn back to red. When you start grabbing it and dragging it, look at that. You can see that new triangles were computed on the fly to adapt to the new shape you want. If I try to grab the wing and add more parts, Look at that, no stretching of triangles anywhere. Sculptures Pro can also be used with smoothing. And when you do so, the cursor will be orange. This is a great way to actually get rid of topology. For example, smoothing is pretty strong with Sculptures Pro. And the bigger you make your brush, the faster it will smooth. Sculptures Pro, by default, depends on the size of your brush to select how big the triangles that it puts down will be. The smaller the brush, the more tiny triangles will be added. Whereas the bigger the brush, the bigger the triangles. You can, if you want to, opt out of this brush size dependency by going to Stroke, Sculptures Pro, and turning off Adaptive Size. Now, whatever the subdivide size you have selected here will be what's applied no matter the size of your brush. A smaller subdivide size will create smaller triangles, whereas a bigger one will create much bigger triangles. Sculptures Pro is one of my favorite features because it allows you to have so much creativity without having to worry about topology and other technical constraints.